With the new iOS 15, Apple has not only expanded total user experience on the iPhone, but they have also added some new additions to their HomeKit for better interaction. These features will increase your home automation experience and make life more convenient as well. Today, we'll discuss what's new for HomeKit with iOS 15. So that being said, let's jump right into it. First, let's talk about home security cameras. This is a big one and we're really excited about it. Apple finally increased the limit of cameras that you can use with HomeKit Secure Video. There are three plans and the 2TB plan will give you unlimited camera activity options so that you can simultaneously stream and record without any shortage of storage. Those who are in the Apple HomeKit ecosystem have been waiting for this one, now they can get some release. Another useful feature is the package detection. In the market, there aren't tons of home security cameras available that can fully integrate with HomeKit. Apart from the crowd, Logitech Circle View and Eufy Cam 2 Pro are among the few which are compatible with HomeKit and have the ability to detect packages when the delivery guy leaves them at your door. Plus, you can communicate with them as this video doorbell features two-way audio. It's a nice little update compared to the previous one. The next big one that you may have heard about is called Home Keys. If you have a level lock touch edition for the August Wi-Fi smart lock, then you're going to love this feature for sure because it lets you store all your digital keys in the wallet app to ensure you can lock or unlock the door automatically and leave your hands free. Now, also new to HomeKit is the addition of Siri-enabled accessories. This means you can control all your third-party smart home devices such as the Ecobee Smart Thermostat through Siri or HomeKit app. In this way, you don't have to buy additional hub or accessories to control non-HomeKit devices. Next is a very welcome feature that allows you to set commands that complete themselves in the given time. For example, you can set a schedule or timer to turn on or off the lights automatically. This feature is really helpful for those who live in a large house or have multiple stair rooms. So, when you do something like this, Siri will generate a new HomePit automation that can be found in the Home app. Last but not least, the Home app on the Apple Watch also got a little facelift now. It's easier to access the intercom and access the status and control all of your HomeKit devices right from your wrist. So that was all about the what's new for HomeKit with iOS 15 just for you. There are also a lot of features that you can do using the latest iOS and HomeKit. Let us know down in the comment section which features you like the most and don't forget to let us know if you've noticed anything else new that maybe we might have missed. Thanks for watching. Like, comment and share this video with your friends if you found it helpful. Subscribe to our channel if you want more videos like this on your feed.